What's up, y'all? Today I'm here with a different type of video. This one's on. I'm gonna, just gonna be showing y'all how to um, do vocal presets or how to make vocal presets, like how to put them in the zip file that I do on most of my videos. This is gonna benefit people that do tutorials like me if they want to give the vocal presets to the people or if they want to sell them. That's gonna um, benefit them. It's gonna benefit artists that record on GarageBand iOS and are trying to sell presets. So, yeah. Um, just watch the video if you want to learn how to do the presets so you can sell them or do whatever you want with them or just save them for yourself I guess all right so basically I um so I, I'd suggest you to have like any noise or like a beat or if you want to add like a hi-hat or something just leave something in there because you need to have some type of audio file in order for, for it to work so for example I have this beat right here so yeah, I have this ran uh this um random beat that I uh, use for from the song rich criminals for my um no cap video so yeah so first things first you want to obviously add the preset so once you do that you click on this little arrow here and you go on my songs after you click on my songs you want to hold on your song then you go here to share then you want to click on project once you click on project it should look like this what you want to do now is click on save to files now you just save it to on your phone or wherever you want to save see i already have one so i'm just going to replace this one so now you want to go to your files and look for your song so my song looks like this right here it's this one you want to hold it and then click on compress this is the most important part of the video click on compress okay so after you compress the uh, the file you should get something like this my song or whatever you named yours so you hold on it just for this one i'm just gonna put no cap and then put vocal or if you're a rapper you put your rapper name and then vocal if you're gonna sell them or whatever ad libs main preset i don't know okay so once you do that you go into some sort of um app or whatever that you want to use and you could use many more you could use um Google Drive, you could use Mega, which is the one I'm using, you could use Dropbox, you could use Mediafire, and I'm pretty sure there's many more. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now, or you guys are supposed to do now, is so you go to the top right, you should see like a little um like paper slash file icon. You click on it, then you click on import from, then you go on browse, and now you look for your um your uh zip whatever you called it i named mine no cap so no cap and then upload and then it should take a while but on the bottom right you should see like an arrow and if you see the arrow it means it's working so once it's done you should see like a little check mark check mark by it and yep so now you have your file here you could just click on the three dots then click on get a link then um just click on the bottom right click on copy link and now you have it and you can send it to whoever you want you can send it to the um, customer or whatever and that's how you get vocal presets and i hope you guys enjoy this video and tell your friends that are garage band ios users link them this video so they can finally start sending their presets and yeah thank you for watching peace